Welcome to the Prep Zone. My name is Grant Yenny. Tonight we're here at Slidell High School for a big district rivalry matchup as North Shore travels to take on the Slidell Tigers. I spoke with both coaches moments ago. Let's hear what they had to say, and we'll get to the action. Pre game with Coach Green. Coach, it's our first time seeing your team this season. Can you give us a rundown on how your season's been uh, up to this point? Yeah, it's been a little up and down. You know, we graduated eight seniors last year, so we depended on a lot of new guys and new faces. But, you know, I think the world of the kids are getting better. I think the morale is getting better. I think we bind together as a team at this moment. What's it going to take to beat North Shore here tonight? I think we play our game, really. We play patient. Uh, don't make it a – I know it's a rivalry game, but don't make it a rival type of basketball. Just play team ball, play Tigers ball against Panthers ball. I think we have a good shot to win it. Bring in with Coach Ward. Coach, it's our first time seeing your team this season. Can you give us a rundown on how your season's gone so far? Uh, we, we've had uh, we've had some uh, positive moments, getting better, you know, each and every game, uh, maturing. We've had some, you know, real fun losses that we've learned from. And it uh, makes us a better team. So tonight is kind of uh, kind of where we kind of really test ourselves against a very good Tigers team uh, that we feel like we match up pretty well with. But um, we're uh, just excited about the challenge tonight. It's a big rivalry matchup. How do you control emotions in an environment like this? That's tough. You know, high school students, they get pretty excited about everything. But, uh, again, we've been in some tough games so far this season. And uh, I think our, our leadership will kind of calm us down and get us through it. Chambers and Caldwell to tip this one away to get this district rivalry matchup underway. North Shore wins the tip. Simon Frankie will bring this one up. A packed gym here at Slidell for this matchup here tonight. A lot of uh, citywide and community pride on the line in this matchup. Here's a three-point attempt for North Shore. Off the mark, rebound for Chambers. A loose ball, Chamber is able to get it back. And that will have our first foul of the game called on uh, Cooper Rachel. So McGee to throw this one in. McGee throws in to Frankie. Back to Chambers. McGee looking for an option to pass to, sends it to Chambers. Driving Chambers up and Chambers is fouled. Foul called on ball. That'll send Chambers to the line to shoot. Chambers 6'4", 185 pound guard for the Panthers. Sinks the first one and gets the Panthers on the board first. Second shot coming from the junior. Second one goes. 2-0 North Shore leading here in the first. Lorenzo Caldwell inbounds. It looks like North Shore are going to be playing end-to-end -end the whole night with the Tigers. This one up. Oh, and the alley-oop attempt doesn't go. Here's North Shore back the other way, up and in. Frankie. Four zero. James Parlo over to Perry. Parlo thought about it, tipped and back in to Ball's possession. Off the mark, Chambers comes down with the rebound. And going back the other way, Dominique uh, Perry comes up with it. Perry off the glass. And that one <laughs> tipped away by Parlo. Up, 
and off the mark. That'll be slide L ball. That called on Frankie. Throw into Caldwell. Three point attempt for the Tigers. Off the mark, here's Caldwell, up and in. Lorenzo Caldwell puts the Tigers on the board. Caldwell, 6'4", 170 pound junior. Loose ball here, Dominique Perry. Up and off the mark, Chambers comes down with the rebound. Chambers reclaiming possession. Zips it out, up off the glass and in. Kendrick McGee, the points leader for the Panthers. And 6-2 North Shore leads here with 4.44 to go in the first. Ratio able to track that one down. This one up and in. Trey Ball for two. And now 6-4. North Shore leading. Bounce pass. Chambers can't haul it in. No, gets it back and lays it in. Great hustle there from the junior Chambers. And we have a timeout on the floor. 4-10 to go here in the first. And North Shore leads 8-4. Throwing goes to Caldwell coming out of the timeout. Caldwell finds ratio. Ball. Driving up and in. Cooper ratio. 8-6 North Shore. Frankie. Out to Chambers. Frankie up and in. And the charge called on the Panthers. So Banks to throw in for the Tigers. In the ratio. Picked off by McGee. McGee driving and denied there by Banks from behind. And the throw in coming for the Panthers. Chambers, oh, and just a communication error. And Banks in the ratio. Tipped away and back into North Shore possession. Porter. Excuse me, Silas. Three point attempt. And then Slidell comes away with it. Dominique Perry. Deep three. Out of bounds for a slide L throw in. Dominique Perry lofting this one up for ratio. That called on Caldwell. It'll be Chambers throw in for the Panthers. Looking to get it back and that's tipped out by Cedric Banks. Hey. 
Silas, bounce pass back to McGee. This went up to Chambers. Chambers dumps it off and blocked away by Banks. Electric slide L crowd. Subs coming in for North Shore now. Perry, throw in, Caldwell up and in. Lorenzo Caldwell extending that 6-4 frame, getting a hold of that one. And putting it up and in, and now Ratio called. James Parlow checks back in as Ratio takes a rest. Chambers throws it in. To okay, this one fed Valentine up and off the mark, and Perry going back the other way. Jumper. And Chambers comes down with the rebound. Driving, lofts it up. Put back on the foul called. Foul called on Parlo. That'll send uh, Fabian Hartley to the line to shoot. Hartley, the second points leader on the team. Also the assist leader, just a sophomore, 6'2", 210. Drains the second. 10-8, North Shore leading. the glass the sophomore guard ties it up 10 10 this went up and into Cedric Banks possession battle for it that's going to be slide L ball Foul called on Valentine. Throw in coming from Perry. Tipped away. Parlo to Perry. Up and Dominique Perry. Drains it there and he'll go to the line to shoot. Perry to shoot. And he drains it. 13-10. Then a timeout on the floor. Slidell leading 13-10 with 57 seconds to go here in the first. Coming out of the timeout, Valentine to throw in for the Panthers. Inbounds to Hatch. Up, and they called a charge on Hartley. Cedric Banks to throw in for the Tigers. 48 seconds to go here in the first. And Parlo brings it up. Looking for an option. 
Launches it long and Cedric Banks gets way up there to pull that one down. 30 seconds to go here in the first. Banks over to Caldwell. Caldwell driving. And North Shore comes down with it. Tatch. Unable to save it there. Slidell wants a foul called. Here's Perry, under 10 to play here in the first. Perry, that's gonna be a jump ball. And let's see, do they, that is the end of the first quarter. So at the end of the first, Slidell leads 13-10. Throw in to kick off the second. This one into Caldwell. Caldwell driving up off the mark. And Hartley comes down with it. <laughs> McGee checking in for the Panthers. Banks into Perry. Dominique Perry to the line to shoot the free throw. Perry with three points on the night so far. Sinks that one and he'll have four. So 14-10, Slidell with the lead. Second shot, drains it. That one tipped away. That'll be, uh, should be North Shore ball. And they're saying that was tipped out of bounds off a slide L player. That wasn't a high pass. Yeah, North Shore fans not liking that. They're rolling it to Slidell. Let's see as they have a discussion here. So they award the ball to Slidell. Yeah, they, to me, from up here, it looked like it was tipped away by a Slidell player. That's what made it go high. And there it's reversed. So North Shore to throw in. That wide open under the basket. Silas for two. Makes it 15-12, Slidell. The raucous gym here at Slidell. Passionate fan bases on both sides. Jumper goes, James Parlow. Valentine back to Chambers. Parlo. Up 
off the glass and in, Dominique Perry. Seven points on the night as Slido leads 19 to 12. Sent out. Oh, off the glass, tipped back. Out to Valentine and tipped up. Perry, wow, what a sequence. There is that one tipped back. And they're gonna call the foul on Banks. Valentine bringing this one up. Chambers looking to drive splitting. Defenders kick this one out. Good ball movement there from North Shore. Silas sent it over to Hatch and taken away by Slidell. Here's Perry. Loose ball. He steps out of bounds. Hatch had a lot of momentum going forward there and stepped out of bounds. So it'll be a throw in for Slidell. And Parlos uh, is saying he's okay, but he because they stopped play due to him being slow to get up, uh, he has to go out for a second as uh, Slido has to send a sub in. Foul called there on Chambers. So that'll send Caldwell to the line to shoot. Caldwell already with four points on the night. The 6'4 junior for the Tigers. Drains it. So Hartley checking back in for the Panthers. And Chambers. Throws in to Silas. Going the other way is Banks. Banks up and in. Cedric Banks, the 6'3 senior. The discussion here. See the officials having to stand very close together. The gym is really loud. So fouls called on both teams. Chambers to throw this one in. Slido going back the other way is Perry. And foul called on Chambers. So Chambers now with three fouls in this game. Ratliff checks in for the Panthers.
Perry off the mark on the first one. Second one off the mark. Hartley comes down with it. Tipped away. Let's see, Slidell gets a hold of it. Here's Banks. Looking for an option to throw to. Banks, three-point attempt, Caldwell off the mark and Chambers goes way up there to get that one. Chambers kicks it out, three-point attempt for the Panthers, rims out, here's Perry going the other way. Perry looking to bring it coast to coast, puts it up, he's off the mark. And another foul called. So foul called on Ratliff. And sends Perry to the line to shoot. First one's off the mark. And Lawson McElroy. Checking back in for the Panthers. Perry to shoot once again. Second one goes. <laughs> Micah Willis called but the foul. The 6-1 sophomore. Chambers drains it. Second shot coming from Chambers. Here's Chambers up off the glass. Slidell comes down with it. And another foul called. Oh, they say out of bounds. So DiMaggio will throw this one in for North Shore. Chambers. Kicks it out. DiMaggio for three. Drains it. Tyler DiMaggio from downtown, the senior guard. 24-16, Slidell leading. That one kept in bounds. Perry. Looking to split defenders, and they're gonna call a kick. So DiMaggio to throw in over here near sideline. Ratliff driving, looking to dump it off, and he thought DiMaggio was going to be to his left. DiMaggio was behind him, so thrown away. He fouled on the putback. It's Trey Ball. And, uh, lost McElroy. Called with the foul. So Trey Ball to shoot. Ball sinks the first one.
Chambers to throw it in for the Panthers. 2.53 to go here before half. Slido leading 26-16. Ratliff, bounce pass up to McElroy. Chambers splitting defenders, looking to drive, puts it up off the mark and back into Slido possession. Dumped off Perry, wide open three. Here's Caldwell with the putback goes. Seven points on the night for Caldwell. This one zipped over to Chambers. Chambers up to Hartley. Hartley losing the handle and back into Slido possession. Charge called on Slidell. <laughs> Throw in from Chambers. Minute 52 to go here in the, <clears throat> excuse me, first half. But up Hartley with the bucket. Fabian Hartley, the second leading scorer for the Panthers. That ball tipped away. Caldwell able to get it back. Up. Oh, and denied. Bounce pass, can't haul it in. And that goes out of bounds. Slidell's ball, Caldwell will throw it in for the Tigers. So into James Parlow. Three point attempt, drains it. Cooper Ratio. The 6'3 junior from downtown and under a minute to play here before half. Slido leading 31-18. Up off the glass and in, Montel Hatch. Caldwell turns up and in. Nine points on the night for Caldwell. Chambers. Keeps his footing there. Three-point attempt. Drains it. Under 10 to play. Perry bringing it up. Perry driving. Slapped away by Chambers as the buzzer sounds. And we go to half. Slide out leading 33-23. Kicking off the second half is Slidell with a 10-point lead. North Shore throwing it in as Chambers sends it in to Frankie. Here's Hartley looking for an option to pass to. Simon Frankie. Now Chambers kicks it out. Working forward and foul called. Called on uh, Perry. This district rivalry matchup here tonight in Slido, it's been electric. The fans been into this one. Chambers called with the travel. So it'll be a throw in for the Tigers. Now Parlo. Over to uh, Rachel. Here's a jumper. 
off the mark and Hartley comes away with the rebound. Out driving up and in, Montel Hatch. Thirty-three twenty-five. Slidell. Here's Perry. Pick set. Perry out to Caldwell. Perry, excuse me, Parlo, jumper, and they're going to say that went out of bounds. So North Shore bringing it up. Frankie out to Chambers. Tipped away, Hatch able to haul it in. And out of bounds, that'll be a slide L throw in. That goes out of bounds off of Montel Hatch. Ratio with the throw in, bounce pass back. Good ball movement there from the Tigers. Caldwell finding ball. Ratio up, swatted away by Hartley. And Frankie. Here's Banks. Banks slips. So Bridges called with a foul there. Looked like a slip to me. If anything, I would think it would be called a travel. Now they need to uh, wipe up a spot on the floor. And now more stoppage down on the floor. Race out to throw this one in. Long pass, Perry looking for Parlo. Parlo up and off the mark and going back the other way of Simon Frankie. Frankie bounce pass looking for Hatch. Hartley out, Chambers for three. And Parlo comes away with the rebound and foul called on Hartley. You know, usually we talk about the foul party in the fourth quarter, but this whole game has been one big foul party and not necessarily, I, I'm, I'm gonna say not necessarily on the players. These officials are really calling anything and everything. Frankie now over to Chambers. Off the side, Chambers, put back goes. So 
Chambers to the line to shoot for North Shore. Drains it. 33-28, Slidell leading the North Shore Panthers. Ratio out to Banks. This one off the glass, put back. Second time goes from Cedric Banks. 4.16 to go here in the third. Slidell leading 35-28. Now Frankie up to Hatch. Banks. Driving up and in. Simon Frankie. And we have a timeout on the floor. 3.22 to go here in the third. Slidell leads 35-30. So Banks to throw this one in. Following the timeout. North Shore has cut the lead to five. Slidell had a 10-point lead at the top of the half. Here's Caldwell. And taken away by Frankie. Tipped away. And Perry going back the other way. Ratio up and in. Seven points on the night for the junior Cooper ratio, and he'll go to the line to shoot. Silas checking in for the Panthers. And Ratio sinks it. This one up. Tipped away, loose ball. Here's Banks picking it up. Perry. Ratio driving. Ratio for three, trains it. Cooper Ratio, his second three of the night, makes it 41-30 for the Tigers. Three-point attempt. And McElroy tips it out of bounds. It'll be a throw in from Emmanuel Smith. Now Trey Ball checking back in. Trey Ball will handle the throw in. Bounce pass, good ball movement from the Tigers. My goodness, ratio up and in. Well done by the Tigers there. Frankie. Up, off the mark. This one to Banks. Banks up and off the mark. Going back the other way is Bridges. Off the glass and in. Simon Frankie. Trey Ball called with the foul.
drains it. And it's a timeout on the floor. Minute 26 to go here in the third. Slido leading 43-33. Banks to throw this one in following the timeout. Minute 23 to go here in the third. Perry to Banks. Perry guarded by McGee. Stolen away. Here's McGee looking to haul it in. McGee up and in. Now under a minute to go here in the third. Perry out the ball to Banks and stolen away. Now loose ball and Slidell gets it back. Perry Caldwell up and a foul called. So 29 seconds to go here in the third and that will send Caldwell to the line to shoot for the Tigers. Caldwell, the 6'4 junior. Go to the line to shoot. First shot coming. Drains it. Now subs coming in for Slidell. Emmanuel Smith checks in as well as uh, James Parlo. Second one goes. 45-35, slide L. 27 seconds to go here in the third. Slung over to McGee. McGee off the glass. Off. Chambers comes up with it. Now Chambers fouled. Foul called on Parlo. First shot is off the mark from Chambers. Second shot. The mark, it looks like a lane violation on North Shore. So Banks to throw this one in. 10 seconds to go here in the third. This one in to Caldwell. Up. Perry, up, off the mark, and the buzzer sounds to end the third. And Slido leads 45-35. Perry to throw this one in to kick off the fourth. It's it in the ratio. Parlo looking for Banks. It's tipped. Banks able to haul it in. Carlo, bounce pass to Caldwell. Double team, Parlo looking for an option to get it to. Here's Ratio. Ball knocked away, Parlo jumper. Caldwell comes up with it. Caldwell off the glass and in. Caldwell called with the foul. So 
Frankie dumping it off to McGee. Bounce pass, Chambers off the glass and in. 45-37, Slidell leads. Banks, bounce pass up to Caldwell. Banks for three. Forty-eight thirty-seven. McGee finds Silas over the rim and it's Parlo going the other way. Ratio. McElroy comes down with it. And here's Caldwell. And Caldwell with the slam. <laughs> Foul called. That will send Kendrick McGee to the line to shoot. Second shot coming. Drains it. 5.50 to go here in the fourth. Slido leading 50 to 38. Perry up to Caldwell. Good feed there. Slido proficient with the ball movement. Ratio up. Foul called on McElroy. Sends Ratio to the line to shoot. Ratio sinks the first one. Banks checking in for North Shore. Emmanuel Smith checking in for Slidell. Second one goes for Ratio. 52-38 Slidell here with 5.17 to play in the fourth. Here's McGee. Out to Chambers, Chambers. Off the mark and Perry comes away with the rebound. Ratio. And Slidell takes a timeout. 4.51 to go here in the fourth. Slidell leads 52-38. Coming out of the timeout, Slidell throwing it in. Here's Perry, 446 to go in the fourth. Perry losing the handle on it now. And Chambers throws it into Valentine. 
Valentine up and off the mark. Foul on Trey Ball. So that'll send Glenn Valentine to the line to shoot. First shot's off the mark. Second shot coming, Valentine sinks it. Ratio to Perry. And that one, losing the handle on it goes out of bounds and last touched by uh, Ratio. So Banks to throw in, excuse me, Bridges to throw in. Chambers gets it past Caldwell. McGee put back, goes for Simon Frankie. And Frankie will head to the line to shoot. Smith called with the foul. Frankie sinks it. Taken back by North Shore. Ratio with the rebound and a battle for it. Let's see, foul called. Yeah, foul called on Chambers. And Fabian Hartley checks in, as well as James Parlow. Banks throws it in. Caldwell driving. Bounce pass out to Banks. Caldwell, picked off there. Swatted down by Glenn Valentine and North Shore going the other way. And Fabian Hartley trying to catch Bridges on the run. That one goes sailing out of bounds. Banks throws it into ratio. Now here's Parlo. Caldwell, up, and a foul called on North Shore. So that'll send Caldwell to the line to shoot for the Tigers. And he sinks the first one. Second shot, drains it. 54-42, Slidell leading here with three minutes to go in the fourth.
And that one out of bounds. It'll be a Panther throw in from Kendrick McGee. And North Shore takes a timeout. So 2.49 to go here in the fourth. Slido leads 54-42. Coming out of the timeout, the throw in to Frankie. Frankie up to Bridges. Bridges driving off the glass, and Ratio comes down with the rebound. Here's Banks. And Banks called with the travel. So Glenn Valentine to throw this one in. As North Shore trails 54-42. Bridges driving, looking to kick it out. Here's a three-point attempt for the Panthers. It's off the mark. Bridges comes down with it, a loose ball now. And Perry finds Parlow. Parlow, jumper. Going back the other way, here's Chambers. McGee up, and that'll be uh, Perry called with the foul. So McGee to the line to shoot for the Panthers. Off the mark. Second shot coming from McGee. Up and in. Minute 45 to go here in the fourth. Slido leading 54-43. Banks sends a long one to Caldwell. Caldwell up off the glass and in. Caldwell has had a sensational game. Nineteen points for the junior Caldwell. And a foul called on Parlo. Sends Kendrick McGee to the line. McGee sinks the first one. Second one, good. Perry, Parlo tipped up. Caldwell gets it, puts it up, and Caldwell's fouled. Foul called on Silas. First one is off the mark. Second one, off the mark, Chambers comes away with the rebound. M McGee looking to get around Parlow there, P driving, launches this one, and out of bounds. Throw in coming here near sideline. And Perry. McGee called with the foul. 
It's McGee's third on the night. And that will send Perry to the line to shoot. Perry sinks it. 57-45, Slido leading. Second shot, good. And a timeout on the floor. A minute five to go here in the game. And Slido leads 58-45. DiMaggio inbounds pass to Bridges. Stolen away by Parlo. Under a minute to play here in this one. Perry up to Caldwell, and they're going to say Caldwell's heels were out. So it'll be a throw in for the Panthers. Bridges up and off the glass and in. Going to Parlo. Parlo lofts it up to Caldwell. Caldwell. Up and in. Three point attempt for the Panthers. Drains it. Chambers from downtown. And a timeout on the floor. Uh, Slido leads 60 to 50 with 28 seconds left. So 31 seconds remaining, and foul is called on Chambers. So that'll send a ratio to the line to shoot. An extra three seconds was run off the clock, so if you heard me say 28 seconds before, they adjusted the clock, made it 31 uh, seconds remaining. Ratio drains the first one. Second shot. Goes. Quickly up court go the North Shore Panthers. That one tipped away. Bounce pass under, up and in is Montel Hatch. Banks sends it in to Caldwell and Caldwell is fouled with 15 seconds remaining in the game. Caldwell sinks the first one. Caldwell has had a sensational night for the Tigers. Second shot. Off the mark. And let's see if they call jump ball. Yes. To Perry to throw in for the Tigers. Bounce pass in the ratio. Ratio up and in. Cooper ratio, another one with a sensational night. Five seconds on the clock. Here's Hatch off the glass and in. And the buzzer will sound to end this one as Slidell is victorious 65 54. So let's send our thank yous to those who helped bring you this game, starting with our superintendent, Mr. Trey False, our director of broadcasting, Dr. Melody Menard, cameraman, editor, and coordinator of Channel 13, Dave the Ray Williams. So from Slidell, will the Slidell Tigers defeat the North Shore Panthers 65 54. My name is Grant Yenny. Good night. You are now leaving the prep zone. <laughs>